Hello, how are you? Today, we're going to talk about Shannon Doherty's video, She Files for Divorce from Husband of 11 Years Curtis Warienko. Right now, watch this, share it with your friends, and we'll show you some specific details in this video. Shannon never wanted to get married. Doherty's agent, Leslie Sloan, says, unfortunately, she felt like she was left with no other option. Kurt Iswarienko and Shannon Doherty are splitting up. On Friday, the enchanted alum sought legal separation from Iswarienko following 11 years of marriage. According to a statement released by Leslie Sloan, Doherty's representative, divorce is the last thing Shannon wanted. Sadly, she felt as though she had no other choice. Sloan likewise affirms that Iswarienko's representative was very familiar with their separation. The divorce document obtained indicates that the couple divorced in January. Doherty is requesting that her estranged photographer husband not receive spousal support. There are no children between the couple. A couple of hours before the insight about the recording broke, Doherty shared a secretive message on Instagram. The post, which was also posted to her Instagram story, read, The only people who deserve to be in your life are the ones who treat you with love, kindness, and total respect. In any case, prior to subtleties, if it isn't too much trouble, please prefer our channel, press the ringer symbol, and then select the option to receive all notifications so that we can keep in touch with you in the future. In October 2011, Doherty and Iswarienko tied the knot. The actress was previously married to Rick Salomon from 2002 to 2003 and to Ashley Hamilton from 1993 to 1994. Doherty told People a year before her wedding to Iswarienko that she was taking her third marriage seriously. She stated at the time, marriage to me is such a huge commitment that it's not something I'd ever go into lightly anymore. I've taken in my illustration. The separation declaration comes one month after Doherty told fans she was feeling perfect at an enchanted board close by Rose McGowan, Holly Marie Brushes, Brian Krauss, Dorian Gregory, and Drew Fuller. The entertainer has gone through the most recent couple of years managing progressing therapies for stage 4 bosom disease. In 2015, she received her first breast cancer diagnosis. She entered abatement two years after the fact yet uncovered in 2020 that her malignant growth had gotten back to organize 4. Since announcing in the year 2020 that the disease had returned the year before, Doherty has made it a point to share all of the good, bad, and ugly aspects of her cancer treatments. Doherty has stated that she feels a responsibility to dispel cancer myths. During a virtual panel for her Lifetime movie list of a lifetime, she told reporters, I feel like I have a responsibility in my more public life, which I separate from my acting life, to talk about cancer and maybe educate people more and let people know that people with stage 4 are very much alive and very active. My significant other says that you could never realize that I have malignant growth, added Doherty. I rarely voice my discontent. I don't actually discuss it. At this point, it's just part of life. I would like to express my sincere appreciation for your time and attention. We hope that you found this story interesting. Please share your thoughts in the comment section. Share this story with your buddies and we'll see you in a little while.